The very notion that we could have a, a photograph of one of the greatest men who has ever lived in America, who has had as great an impact as any person who has ever lived in America, the notion that we could find a photograph of that man is exciting almost beyond words. You begin to say, what, what does he really look like? A lot of people have looked at the death masks and said, well, how accurate are those representations of the image of Joseph and Hiram? We have created images of great prophets in the past, even of the Savior, so that those images have become so common to us that we recognize them as who we think they are. The question has loomed in the minds of scholars and, and members of the church in general throughout the years as why have we never had an authentic photograph of the prophet Joseph Smith? 15 or 20 years ago, um, we began to hear the rumors of a, what might actually turn out to be an image of Joseph Smith. For the probability or the possibility of an actual photograph of Joseph Smith existing seems to be real in many people's minds and people have searched and, and uh, gone through archives and, and uh, family trunks and attics to try and find a possible photograph and from time to time there is a photograph that surfaces that people think could be the prophet Joseph Smith. We've really put together this wonderful rubric of scholarly work that we're able to compare now actual facts of what Joseph Smith looked like to these alleged daguerreotypes and come up with a reasonable analysis whether they are probable or whether they are not the prophet Joseph Smith. As we were first approached with this project, we were shown an unknown photograph that we were told may be of Joseph Smith. In all honesty, it, it didn't look like anything that we felt Joseph Smith looked like. As we began over the weeks to, to delve through the information, uh, take measurements, use, use scientific information, um, it became rather clear to us that this began to appear to be Joseph Smith. Um, not from any historical belief we had, but from the scientific and clinical um, data we gathered. And at the end, we, we really felt this is what he must have looked like. My reaction was warm, and uh, I wanted it to be Joseph Smith, perhaps because I wanted to have a, a, a real image of him, a photograph, something that, that I could come to know him a little better. I think the daguerreotype is Joseph, I do. I really hope it is, that may be part of it, but I, I like, the way it conforms to the physical data that we have about the way his face was laid out. It just, it fits, everything fits. The, the comparisons between the, the death mask and this, this photograph um, are, are very compelling. And I, I just feel like they're, they're not something that an honest person is just going to disregard offhand. Joseph died just at the beginning of the age of photography. And consequently, there have been many people who have supposed that there was probably a photograph of him taken. However, uh, that no such photograph has been found until now.